And I'm back in my yard again. And I'm showing you my blackberry plant that's covered with some uh, ashes, soot, if you will. And um, look right here. See those little, look like blades of grass. Those blades of grass are coming up because uh, it's been so warm here. It's, it's in December, it's 27th today, and it's still been so warm. These are my new trees here. I came out here today to count them. And uh, this tree here is, um, God, what is this tree here? This tree here, and I, I like the color of it, but it, this is a um, honey crisp. That's what that is, honey crisp tree. And uh, should have the label on it. And it says uh, Fuji. Wait a minute. That's a Fuji. Okay, I remember now. I remember what I did. And this one here is a uh, Granny Smith. And you can see all of them have leaves around them because I fed them leaves early in the year. That's when you, I do it. And uh, that's how that's done. So I didn't get a lot of wood chips this year. I had two offers and could have gotten them both, but uh, didn't work out. And this one here is fed as well. You can see the, the, the leaves around it. There we go. And I uh, uh, see these little bugs on the ground. I don't know what they are, but they look like little, little snails, but they're not. They're rolled up, in fact. And this one here is a honey crisp. And uh, they're already been in the ground for about a month and they're anchored in the ground already they're anchored already you know connecting themselves in the ground real tight and uh, that's a good thing about it and you see right here is my um, another one of my um, cherry trees and uh, they're quite well very well this is supposedly be a tortellini, and it's it's doing quite well. Beautiful um, tree here looks green and healthy. And I put this wood at the bottom because you know I'm going to use pieces of wood down at the bottom like I would uh, mulch. Just put it down; it'll eventually rot. But um, I'm trying this out because I'm a little low on wood chips. So what I'll do is I'll cover this over with wood chips, and it won't hurt anything. It actually will help. And this is my oldest, um, my oldest, uh, what's this called, a uh, peach tree. And this is a Hail Haven peach. And it's very healthy. And you can see the, the buds on them in the dead of winter. You can see that. And I'm trying to keep these things healthy, these trees. Yeah. And they're doing quite well. I got my water emptied out, ready for spring, emptied out to avoid freezing. And this is another cherry tree. I mean, excuse me, this is a uh, peach tree here. And it is in great shape. It is doing really well. Everything's green and healthy on it. And this is a fruit producing piece of wood here because of the purple coloring. And we go over here and we got uh, another peach tree. This is a uh, Hell Haven. And, um, and we see we got some type of insect lava here. It looks like it's from a praying mantis. And I'll remove that. Well, actually, yeah, I'll get I'll have it removed. And it's doing good. And then we got another peach tree here. This is a, and you see all the food around it.